A rare find in an Oakland basement has film buffs and historians both buzzing. It's a 35-minute silent movie that was in one family's possession since 1916. And now, nearly 100 years after it was made, this film is shedding light on the lives of Chinese Americans in the Bay Area way back then. ABC 7's Alan Wong has the story. When filmmaker and San Francisco native Arthur Dong uncovered the earliest known Chinese American feature film, he was amazed. The 1916 film was still preserved on highly flammable nitrate film stock. It was pretty nerve wracking because it could have exploded, or it could have been all gel, or it could have been just powder. 92 years ago, Marion Wong wrote, directed, and shot a feature film in Oakland. Her cousin was the star in the movie called The Curse of Quan Guan. If you put it up against other films of that era, it's pretty first rate. They were Chinese Americans using cutting edge technology of the time. And very few women were making films, and not to say men were making films at that time. So for a woman who is also Chinese American to be doing this, it's astounding. It was a major, major discovery, archival discovery. Stephen Gong is the executive director of the Center for Asian American Media. He says the American Academy of Arts and Sciences considers this a gem. The Asian images that you see in this silent film are in stark contrast to the ones that people were viewing in the big Hollywood movies of that time. Most silent films portrayed Asians as mysterious opium-smoking deviants, and most were based on popular melodramatic plays. They're almost Victorian storylines. You almost see nothing of the real lives and the real issues that face regular people. And here we have it being Chinese-American. Here we have it for the Chinese in 1916. The Curse of Quan Guan is about Chinese assimilation into American society. And it tells you also how important it is to have people tell their own stories. So what a great find that somebody was trying to tell that story and share it with us. During a one-time only viewing at the Grand Lake Theater in Oakland, the audience will get the full effect. It'll be accompanied by the mighty Wurlitzer, the way silent movies were shown back in 1916. This is not only Chinese American history, but it's really film history in general. In Oakland, Alan Wong, ABC 7 News. And as you can see there, it is in remarkably good condition, this film. There is a one-time screening of The Curse of Quan Guan tomorrow night at Oakland's Grand Lake Theater. To find out more about this movie and its history, go to abc7news.com and click on See It on TV. Fascinating piece of history.